Hey guys, and welcome back to Delf. And we got 5 million sales. Oh yeah, we are doing great. And with that note, we have a lot of research. So let's go ahead and start training these guys up. Now, Sarah, you're getting really close to being able to be a specialist. So we need to focus on you, Charles, and Brandon. Get you trained up in design as well, I believe. Yep. And Brandon, let's get you trained up in technology. Now, the rest of you don't do anything. Because we're just focusing on them. Okay, Sarah, you're done. Let's get more training. More training. Oh, there we go. Gameplay, story and quests, design specialist. Okay. A hundred RP to be design specialist. 200 RP for gameplay or story. Okay. So she's got enough. That means these guys, Charles and Brandon. Oh my god, Brandon's really close. Brandon, you didn't hit it, did you? I train you. Oh, you have enough to be a technology specialist. Okay, this is huge. So that means you guys are all going on vacation. When you're coming back, we are going to go ahead and develop a new game. So, okay. We're back. We're really in the positives again. Past where we were, which was a 200 million, which is pretty darn great. But now, actually, can I research? Is there any new topics that are in a business? That doesn't sound interesting. That's fine. Okay, Brandon, come on back. Okay. okay, let's develop one more sequel. Make it a little easier for us. Now, we don't want to do going to the dubbies again. We just did that recently. Now, the game of Dife, though, did really well. So let's... Do you want to do a game... Uh, a game of Dife? Let's show what engine we used. It is not, but we did really well on this. So let's go ahead and make a sequel. Adventure Simulation, and we're doing the same kind of platform, but this time just the newer version of them. And we're gonna call it Game of Dife. It's Dife Lear. And this one's gonna be, this time it's gonna be a large game for everyone. Did it fit? Dife Lee. Or, okay, just making sure it fit. Go. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Engine, engine. Norse engine, epic point one. Everything else is good, everyone? Okay. I'm not making the same mistake, I'm putting it on freaking mature and then. Ah, oh, things did not go well. Okay. So this is. Life. Life game. For adventure simulation. I think what we want to do. Not have any uh, and not have any uh, engine and get a lot more story and quests. I think that's what we did last time. Gameplay was secondary to it, to story and quests. We need to get more stuff for story and quests, actually. Okay, engine, we're gonna drop basic, we're gonna drop um, multiplayer. And if I drop I need to raise engine just a tad, just enough so it can take care of everything there. Uh, we don't want, don't need co-op play. Don't really need this. We can get use that. We can use that. Yeah. So let's do with this. Um, can we throw in multiplayer? No. Mod support is huge for for adventure simulation. I think. Uh, linear story as well. There we go. I mean, get more stuff for these things. Uh, do I want any more gameplay? You know what? I think story quests are a little more important, so I'm actually going to drop this a little bit more. Something like that. Oh, uh, 93%. Actually, we can't drop it. Okay. Fine. It's fine. Let's do it. And immediately, everyone boost. I want you to give it your all. 
We're gonna market this thing. But I believe in you. Our last sequel didn't do well. But this is Game of Dife, guys. Uh, yeah. Life Adventure Simulation game. More graphics or in sound? I want to say more graphics. Going to gra for, uh... I'm going with more graphics. I hope I'm right on this one. I'm actually not sure. Adventure Simulation. Uh... Agree with this. Okay. I was a little worried about since a simulation you usually don't care about the graphics as much. But adventure you kind of do, so. I don't know. Okay. Development stage two. So we're gonna definitely gonna want um, you up there. I think we're going to drop both of you guys down. Question is how much more dialogue do I want for it? I think. Okay, let's get dialogues enough to get everything. Now, I'm going to need a little bit more AI, because I want to grab everything in there. And level design can stay down there. This takes care of absolutely everything. Now, I'm going to throw Brandon instead of Paul in this. And we have two people completely at zero. And one is good in uh, design, a little more than tech. Well, Paul's just better overall. Brandon's tech is huge. Um, so you know what? Let's get Amy instead of Brandon on here. Yeah, let's do that. I, I have a feeling that's going to be slightly better. Strong audience is young. Once again, we're, we're not going to be doing that. I think at this point, strong audience is like, if you get lucky and it fits, better for you. Otherwise, it happens. Ooh, large booth. Perfect timing. Thank you. I completely approve this. Okay. So, world design, really important. So, let's get world design up. Sound down. We'll sound up enough to get freaking stereo sound. Can't go with basic sound. That'd be crazy. Now, world design. Paul can take care of that. Actually, Paul, take care of graphics. Okay, why is that so high? Oh, because we have Paul doing both things. Uh, world design, Amy, Brandon on sounds. That actually is pretty nice. Amy is a little bit overworked. I increase sounds a bit. There we go, 100%. Can we fit dynamic? Oh, we can't. We need to drop graphics. Can I drop graphics? How far can I drop graphics? World design still 95%. Oh my god, we can do it this way. Amy's gonna be way overworked though. We can fit in everything, but Amy will be overworked, so we're not gonna get the bonus on that. I think I'm gonna drop open world. And I can get more. I can drop, raise that up. And probably, yeah, right there. Yeah, I don't want her overworked. Let's do that. And these guys' boosts are about to be back. And boost, boost, boost. Oh, yeah. One last quick push near the end, guys. That's all I can ask for. I was building up with this game. Oh, and G3. It's perfect timing. Look, guys, it's Game of Dive. Wait, Game of Dive? Oh, crap. I misspelled it. <laughs> game of Dive. Uh, number one again. For a number one company, we are terrible at spell checking our games. 150 bucks, holy crap. Almost 550 uh, hype. Is that the record hype? Have we ever had higher than the 550? Jeez. 
Okay. Bugs are gonna be ironed out, and we're gonna finish this up. Launch this game. It's gonna be a success. Because the last one was a giant sub Oh, come on. Who was responsible for that? Level and AI leveled up. That's huge. I released the company for Mbox early next year. Mbox Next? Oh crap, it's already the Mbox Next versions? Wow. It's reminiscent of the earlier Mbox 360. A much lighter tone. Marking departure for the bulky and dark style of the Mbox 1. This seems promising. We see. Okay. Self learning AI. That's 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 creepy. I don't know how well that's gonna happen. That's gonna work. Okay. Train. Design specialist. Start. That's pretty much all of our research points, unfortunately. Oh! Oh! Ah, oh, shit. Eight. Okay. You know what? If you want to be like that, it's slightly worse than the last one. I think the last time we did, we got that well because there was a boost to it. Even though, you know, we have more people, we're more experienced, and we're just overall better, clearly that didn't matter. Go ahead and generate game report, Dave. Clearly, they don't care about us. I mean, we got quite a bit of money, but... Great responses. Well, thank you. But the responses were not great enough. I believe once Sarah actually researches this, we're going to unlock, be able to unlock a new area. But I don't recall if that's the case or we need something else. We can open our own research lab. Yes! We got it. We got a research lab, guys. R&D, your lab is ready. Ah, there we go. We got 3D graphics, six hardware, AAA games. It, oh, there we go. Not very important. Yep, we're doing great. And here it is, our research lab. Welcome to your very own research and development lab. At the moment, it's, it's empty. But we have a number of skilled people eager to start working. You don't have to hire them individually. Instead, you can simply decide on the budget in our D-Lab. The higher the budget, the more researchers will work, and the higher the research progress will be. It can be very expensive, so be very careful so you don't overspend. I suggest you start with smaller projects and don't be afraid to cut down on budget if necessary. Okay. Once you start a project, you can also cancel it the same menu. Ooh, start a project. Ooh, we can increase the budget. So what projects do we have? We can have our own conventions. We can have internet opportunities. And investigate how we can use the internet to make better games and deliver better experience. Beating this project should unlock new options for research. 3D graphics v6. I kind of want to. Hardware. We can make our own hardware. That's huge. And we can make AAA games. Okay, so I think for now, what I'm going to do is not do any of them. I'm just going to increase the budget. Ooh, month? Hold on, get, get back there. Why'd you move away? Um, Three million a month. Stop, stop moving. So everyone is in here. So what I, because what I want them is to start generating research points. Ooh, Micronoft's Mbox next will hit the market, and today Vonnie just said that. Keeping with the company tradition, and in contrast to competitor market outstanding practices, the newly announced aptly named PlaySystem 5. Oh, look at that beauty. Promise to be solid update, but we will see how the new console will fare against its competitors. Okay, so I want to get a little more research. Amy's tired. Let's go on vacation. So, I think the best uh, thing to do right now, because we have 340 million, so we can save a little bit. We're about to hit 100 research. Okay, so Charles now can go ahead and train and become a, another design specialist. Um, yeah, let's go another design specialist, because I believe if you have multiple design specialists, it reduces the R&D uh, cost. Game of Dive 
a hundred million in sales. We are doing great, guys. Not gonna lie, we are doing mwah. Oh, and these guys are all getting tired, so it's a good thing I didn't start making a game. And Box Nest next has been released. Oh, that's huge. Okay. So on vacation. Yep, it's 2.9 million a month a month in the bottom right hand corner instead of the three. So we save a little bit of money a month. Send everyone on vacation. And then we'll develop a new game. Now I kinda wanna wait for the place the next play system to come out. But we are starting start losing a lot of money. Brandon's still not back. Come on, Brandon. Right there he is. Okay. What do you want to do? We have 79 research. You know what? Let's let's go ahead and research some stuff. Let's go ahead and do. We need some starting quest stuff. So 79. We're about to hit 80. So let's wait for the 80. There it is. Let's go ahead and research. Actually, we can do 240s instead. Let's do branching story. And let's go ahead and do. Uh, video playback for engine. Let's do... We could do another world design. We have a lot of world design stuff. I don't think we have a lot of level design, but mini games doesn't sound interesting. Sound. We need more sound stuff. There we go. Soundtrack. That's gonna help out. This is a good episode. Lots of progress being made here. Yeah. These guys are almost done, and there we go. Play System 5 has been released. That's what I was waiting for. Now, the only thing... I'm not gonna put those into a new engine just yet. I'm just going ahead and develop a sequel. Um, Death for Death 3 didn't do so well. Already. Uh, is there anything that did really well? 8... No, no. You guys just have to make a new game. Not make a sequel to anything. Even Dumb did okay. 8.75. Medieval RPG. Now, you know what? Let's make a new game. Let's develop a new game. A whole new IP. Large. What do we want to do, though? Let's do... We haven't done post-apocalyptic in a while. Law. Ooh, let's do a law game. Or... Transport? Music, fantasy... Uh, let's do... Something really different. Let's do fashion. And, ca and fashion is of course to be a casual... Casual. Casual simulation. Has to be. The question is, what platforms are we putting on? Actually, I just realized we just unlocked the consoles that this would not be well on. So screw it. Let's do... Uh, Southwest now. We Let's do horror. When was the last time we did horror? And for horror, we're just gonna do a regular action-adventure horror game on the PC, the PlayStation System 4, and the Mbox next. Wait. Yes. Oh, oops. Play System 5. There we go. With Doris Engine Epic Point 1. And we're gonna call it... Delone. In the Dark. Three D. See, it's a play on words, because there's three Ds. And it's also in 3D. Yeah, you see that? Ah. Okay, I'll say a line up, sorry. I'm a terrible human being, I, I know. Okay. <sighs> what do you want for an action adventure? It's been a while since we made one, actually. I think we're gonna want engine. And I think we can drop the story and quest. Gameplay is kind of important. But what can we throw in it for engine? I think we're just throwing everything for engine. Gameplay, let's get that up to 100. 
And actually, let's see. I want to throw in co-op for action adventure. We can't do that. You know what? Let's do... Uh, I don't even want to do it. Character progression achievements. Game tutorials. We need specializations. We really do. Yeah. Starting quest we can probably drop. Yeah, we can drop it pretty low. And now we can increase gameplay. Yeah, we can increase gameplay. It's all max, yeah. So can we throw in anything else into gameplay? Uh yeah, if we did that. Do you want skill trees instead of achievements and tutorials? An action adventure game. You know what? Let's do that. I'm a little more happier with that. Now, I'm just going to make sure that we have the right people on the right thing. Engine is Brandon. Charles is in gameplay. Story and quest is eight. Yeah. Because we now have a full team. And I want to make sure that everyone's doing the right thing. Let's go ahead and market this large campaign. And let's get everyone boosting. God, it's like being, doing drugs, right? <laughs> boosting. They boost at the beginning and they boost at the end. The alone in the dark. 3D. Come on. Can we make 2 million? No, 1.5 cents. Not there yet. But we're still number one. People cannot compete with us. We are the greatest. Oh shit, I just realized there's a wolf, a wolf poster is there. That's hilarious. Okay. So this time, we're gonna drop dialogues. Uh, yeah, drop dialogues. And we're gonna want a lot of AI. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think that's it. And I think you can throw up a little more of that. So AI, we got both. Dialogues, we're dropping you, and we're dropping you. Yeah. How do we want to do this? Let's do it a hundred. Let's just do enough for a hundred. One hundred. Let's get perfect right on there. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's how it's going to do. Now, I've actually never um, done marketing twice. And I wonder if that actually would work to build more hype. Do like marketing each each session. I only ever done it at the beginning. Hmm. Kind of expensive to throw out four million if it doesn't do anything. I don't know. Maybe I should. Okay, Amy, you're definitely overworked. You're not doing that. Sarah, we'll take care of you. Oh, that is actually beautifully uh, spread out. Too bad that we actually don't need world design. <laughs> we need a lot of graphics. Any world design we're gonna put in there. And sound, we're just gonna... Just enough to get by. We still don't have anything in there. Dynamic world can drop. World design. Yeah, let's do something like this. 106 for Paul. Let's get him to 104. Let's get 100. There we go. Yeah. That's gonna be good, and these guys are gonna be ready to boost in any moment. Come on. It's like doing heroin. You're gonna boost. You ready, Dave? There we go. Yeah, they can't wait to boost. They wait for boosting forever. They're like, oh, just give me the boost. Give me that boost. Oh, yeah. I don't know. Don't ask. It's been a long day. <laughs> uh, lots of bugs. Well, that's okay. We did set this game to mature, right? Ah, oh, crap, I don't remember. Now look at that research points. That's what we really needed. The, the design specialist to unlock the R&D lab. So yeah, now. There we go. Oh. Oh, it's normalized again. Okay. Nothing big. Finish. Lots of technology. Holy crap, new record. Oh, new combo, good management. 3D graphics V5 leveled up. That's really nice. Okay, how do we do? First reviews are in. Oh, not fantastically. Pretty much a mediocre game. 
Okay, just because I said it's mediocre doesn't mean you need to lower the score to be actually mediocre. God damn you people. 6.5. Okay. Bye. Yo. Yep. I see how it is. Brandon, let's train you up to be a technology specialist. Okay. Yeah, we're doing great. Tom, let's go train you up. You need more technology. Yeah, let's start training you there. Amy, let's train you up. You are pretty gonna be you're gonna be balanced, so let's get some stuff figured out. What do you do? And Paul, you need more technology, you need more balance as well. So let's get you doing the RD course. Find out what that one does. So this is good. This is good. Uh, we're getting a lot of research points, so we're going to be able to spend it to level up our game engine quite a bit right now. Amy is getting tired. It's okay, Amy. It's all worth it. You are part of the number one gaming studio in the world. Everybody wants to work here. It's Dow. They have great vacation plans. They pay you really well. Everyone's super happy always. Let's go ahead and train you up. Now you need a little more technology. Let's get technology up. Now, Sarah, I believe, yeah, I have enough to do a specialist. So let's go with a gameplay specialist. Let's do it. So now Sarah's going to do nothing except gameplay. And it's going to be fantastic. Okay, we have 50. Um, uh, can we see, Charles, you need a little more design. Let's get you on design course. Okay, this is good, this is good. And are they getting tired? Yes, they're getting tired. Perfect. So this is where I want it to be. Next time, we're going to make a fantastic game, develop a new game engine with all the research points being unlocked and become even more awesome than 52 million in sales. See you soon. Bye-bye. Consume it's about to die. potion. Get that ready, it's got Igni ready. Okay, that little skull of green is- It's been a while since the last time I forgot to turn my phone on uh, silence when recording. Okay, there you go. Sorry about that. Very unprofessional. There we go. Nope. I rebound the keys and it threw me off. Okay.